Head on over to our affiliates at inkgaming.com to pick up play mats, deck boxes, sleeves, anything that you need to get your game night going. Maybe even get yourself a custom play mat. Check out the link in the description below. Which I do not, so... How many uh, you got? <laughs> let me, hang on, let me get back to you. Uh, can you send that report to you in the morning? Uh, this might, my this might take a while to count. Uh, did you not did get, you get the get memo? memo? <laughs> mm. I'll make sure we send one over to you. Whoops. Oh, oh so yeah, the damage does up. get through. Okay. Oh, oh. Sorry about that. It's uh, new. Again, it's new. Again, this is the first time I'm doing this. It oh, was that's fair. suspected, I, and I didn't, I didn't read into suspected at all, because I don't think my deck does it. I think, in order to spread the damage around nicely, I'm going to send Nelly Borka at you. Okay. So it's a 2-4 Vigilance. Okay. But then I am going to suspect Chris's Vampire. I had a peel. So and I'm going to goad it. You're not doing anything, or...? <laughs> I, I didn't do <laughs> anything! <laughs> well, no, you're Leave like, me alone! He was no. moving his dice and no, his... No, you're just like... You haven't activated his trap card yet. Okay. You said, is everything declared? And it's like... I just wanted to know if that was everything! Good God! Three mana up, it's a little... You, know. you got 27 cards in your hand, he was just a little curious, that's all. Yeah, you, yeah. you gotta understand. <laughs> I only rolled a two. I get three. Three. Fifteen. Wow. Yay! You got more than all three of us combined. He gave a single digit dice. Yeah. And then... Well, that's... And that was what I was supposed to do. <laughs> Why are there only ones and twos and threes on mine? Yeah, right? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> I don't want them to know. <laughs> know the truth. <laughs> We're go we gotta find the truth, though. Yeah, the truth. <laughs> all right. Welcome to the murder that's happening here. Or, well, no, I don't know. It's murders at Karlov Manor. So we're going to try to figure out who did it, right? Is that I'm going to try to murder all three of you, so... Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> so we will know who the murderer is at the end of the game. <laughs> Spoilers. <laughs> so if you guys... Uh, have <laughs> so if you guys uh, have subscribed or not subscribed, please do. Please subscribe, like... Do all the things, hit all the buttons. Yep, share share some of our videos with your friends. Uh, check out some of our other stuff too. We have a whole backlog from last year. If you want, if you haven't checked those out, you can check them down below. <laughs> so, like I said, we are playing the precons. What we like to do is we like to get the precons unaltered. We're playing them right out of the box, sleeve them up, and we're ready to go. So, with that said, I since I rolled the highest, I guess I'll kick us off, right? I'm glad you solved that mystery. Ah. <laughs> Alright, well today I'm playing Morska Undersea Sleuth. It is a legendary Videlkin fish detective. It's a merfolk in my opinion. Uh, I have no maximum hand size. At the beginning of my upkeep, I investigate, which is creating a clue token. And whenever you draw your second card each turn, put two 1-1 one -one counters on Morska Undersea Sleuth. It's a 2-3 Bant. So that's blue, white, and green. Uh, I took a look at the deck. It's very much clue heavy, so... And making, investigating, and sacrificing, and one one counters, and drawing cards, and hopefully uh, destroy all of you. Murder! <laughs> Alright, Vince, what you got? Alright, I'll be playing Mirko, Obsessive Theorist. It is black blue. Um, it's a vampire detective, 1 3 flying vigilance. Whenever I surveil, I put a 1 1 counter on Mirko, and at the beginning of my end step, I may return target creature card with power less than Mirko's from my graveyard to the battlefield with a finality counter on it, and that means if it would die, I exile it instead. So my original thought was it's going to be a vampire deck, but I do not think so after looking at it now. Uh, going to probably be surveilling a lot and hopefully get a lot of use out of my creatures, so if they die, I get to bring them back and 
go from there. Hopefully pump up and swing in for the kill with my commander. See what happens. Use, use your dead creatures to make us dead, yeah. as it were. <laughs> yeah, maybe there's more zombies in there since that's usually what they do. <laughs> I don't know. Was it, uh, he was in the original Ravnica and so uh, Mirko, I don't, uh, I don't, Blood Drinker? Or, or, no. Or am I he, thinking the wrong No, he, Mirko originally appeared in the in Dragon's Maze. Uh, so still Ravnica. Yes. Because we are on the plane of Ravnica, so. Yeah. <laughs> she got, Dan? Speaking of planes. <laughs> All right. I am playing Nelly Borka, Impulsive Accuser. Uh, legendary creature, human detective. I guess she detects humans. Uh, vigilance. <laughs> Whenever Nelly Borka, Impulsive Accuser, attacks, suspect target creature. Then goad all suspected creature. A suspected creature has menace and can't block. Whenever one or more creatures an opponent controls deals combat damage to one or more of your opponents, you and the controller of those creatures each draw a card. Ooh. So my job is to make them do the work for me. Oh, nice. Make us beat each my other. Goal. My goal is to make you guys fight. <laughs> it's very suspect of you. He did it. <laughs> Go on. This is like, no, I didn't. No. No, you did it. <laughs> Chris thinks you didn't do it. Well, pretty sure you did. We shall see. Right. Yeah, let's see. My commander up next is Kaust, Eye of the Glade. They're a Dryad Detective 2-2 two, two for two mana, uh, split red, white, and a green. Whenever a creature I control that was turned face up this turn deals combat damage to a player, draw a card. You can also tap them to turn target face down, attacking creature I control face up. So this, this is basically the uh, uh, Morph 2 Electric Boogaloo Precon. Um, <laughs> Uh, I remember when the first Morph deck came out, it looked pretty cool when I never got into it, and uh, I'm kind of happy that they um, were getting a new Morph uh, deck in some different colors, especially with uh, red red and white, so it's going to be fun to surprise you guys with some big creatures that just lurk and face down on my board. What was the name of that other commander? I'm trying to remember. Uh, Savine Slinking Sorcerer, I believe. I just remember the name, Slinking. but I do have the deck. Yeah. So if you guys like to see that deck played, let us know. Yeah. All right, so a lot of detectives. They're all detectives. They're all detectives. I detect humans, you detect fish. <laughs> so vampires, Fidelkin fish, <coughs> merfolk. Uh, dryad and humans. And I detect the start of a game. <laughs> very, <laughs> very good. All right. So I will kick us off. Draw. All right. I will play this Temple of Enlightenment. Enters the battlefield, tap. When it enters the battlefield, I'll scry one. Taps for blue or white. Hmm. I'll leave that there. Go ahead, Mince. Draw. Island. Pass. <laughs> Draw. <laughs> You're just going to play an island and pass? Planes. Yes, yes I am. I'm going to tap it for a soul ring. Oh. So I'm going to tap to land cycle and ash barons. So ash barons, uh, tap to add one mana or basic land cycling for one. Discard this card. Search your library for a basic land card. Reveal it. Put it in your hand. Shuffle. So that'll be the end of my turn. But what is the soul ring? But here's a mountain. <laughs> uh, tap for two mana. Yeah, but one more thing. You got one mana left in your pool. See? Yeah, it's going to burn me. Fair enough. <laughs> Sit, we're reversing a rule just for this game. No, I'm kidding. Oh my gosh, you imagine? Oh, it burns! <laughs> All that spicy food! <laughs> oh, man. Alright, well, I'll draw for turn. put that back into the deck. That'd be a mistake. Yeah. And I'll play Shrine of the Forsaken Gods. Uh, taps for colorless. You can also tap and add two colorless. You can only spend this mana to cast colorless spells. Activate only if I control seven or more lands. Which I do not. So, how many uh, you got? <laughs> let me hang on. Let me get back to you. Uh, can you send that report to you in the morning? Uh, this might, my this might take a while to count. Uh, Did you not get, you get the memo? memo? <laughs> mm. I'll make sure we send one over to you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Go ahead, Ken. Glasses. Untap. Draw. Hey. Ooh. I'll play an exotic orchard. I get to add one mana <laughs> of any color. That land an opponent controls <laughs> could produce. So. 
Uh, you play green, so I don't have green right now. Who's <laughs> one shaped apples? Uh, <laughs> I will tap these two, and I will play an Idol of Oblivion. Uh, I get to tap it, draw a card, activate only if you create a token this turn, which I do whenever I get my commander, or pay eight, tap it, sacrifice Idol of Oblivion, create a 10-10 colorless Eldrazi creature token. Ooh, it's oh, right up my alley. That's why you wanted to play in the deck. It has Eldrazi in it. Of course. It's my thing. All right, let's put that to the side. Nothing else I can do. Go ahead, Vince. Boy, oh boy. I will draw. I think I'm going to have to just pass. Yeah, but but there's a reason. For the season. Because I don't have anything else, and this is the only smart play is to build up for mm. later. So we're going to put out that Demir Aqueduct and return the island to my hand. Bounce land. How many cards do you have in your hand now, Vince? Seven in a second here. Ah. Oh. Let's see. I'll be able to get some of these back later. Is, so, it, is it discard? Yeah. I'm going to discard the dog's detective. The dogged detective? Read it as you may. The doge detective? Pass to you. Doged. <laughs> On tarp. Draw. I will play a mountain. Then... Oh no, he's got his mana. <laughs> yeah. Do. He could cast his command wow. for holy That's cards. why I played this now to That's try to good. worry about catching up. That's crazy. That's good though, he kind of wants to be aggressive. Be -e aggressive. Does it have haste? No. It doesn't, but no, he but... can get there, he can get going. Let's do it. Woo. Nelly Borka, Impulsive Accuser. I just kind of made that spur of the moment. Decision. All right. Oh. <laughs> Vigilance, whenever Nelly Borka, Impulsive Accuser attacks, sus uh, suspect target creature, then goad all suspected creatures. Whenever one or more creature an opponent controls deals combat damage to one or more of your opponents, you and that controller of those creatures each draw a card. So get something out with haste. Yeah, I was going to say, get attack me. somebody so I can draw a card. <laughs> get that thing out before Fair everybody enough. else is super good. Because oh. now every creature that comes out one at a time, you can just... I can poke it. It yeah. won't attack me. Yeah, yeah. that's... I influenced him. I tricked him into doing it. Mm. Thanks, Ken. <laughs> Remove <Whoa>. him. <laughs> oh, that's coming. <laughs> don't you know don't me, pray. Surely. I'm surely. not the problem. <laughs> don't fret. <That's> <laughs> don't call me Shirley. <laughs> You're the problem as soon as you said, let me play this soul ring. <laughs> yeah. Turn one. <laughs> the scariest turn for a soul ring. All right. I'll play Burrow's Garrison. There's play tapped. There's play I have to return another land, a land I control to my hand. So I'll put the shrine back. Okay. And that's my turn. You did what I did. Yeah. <laughs> How many cards in your hand? Well, I had to ball again, so I'm only at seven cards exactly. Oh, uh, well, I didn't right. think you did. I guess we're sticking to that rule. No kidding. Yeah. <laughs> guess it's a thing now. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Untap. Draw. I was going to ask me how many cards I have. Well, Eight. We're about to find out. I'll play a Reliquary Tower. You have no maximum hand size. Taps for colorless. Then I will tap all three of these, and I will play a Nettle Nettle Cyst? It's a living Ooh. weapon. When, it, uh, when this equipment enters the battlefield, create a 0-0 zero, zero black Phyrexian germ uh, creature token and attach it to it. Germ. Attached. And it equipped creature gets plus one plus one for each artifact and or enchantment you control. Oh, cool. oh wow. So it currently is a two two? Yes, yes. Yes. So And you thought you were scary, Dan. <laughs> he still is. Well he, he, uh, he is. Yeah, he can <laughs> 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 He can cause chaos. <laughs> um obviously I'm out of mana, so uh -huh. you could, oh wait. I'm gonna tap the idol of oblivion. Draw a card, activate only if you created a token this turn, which I did, so I will draw. I already noticed. And <laughs> I will pass. Yeah. All right, untap and draw. I like what Ken did there, so I will also play a Reliquary Tower. And I like what Dan did there, so I will cast my command. <laughs> oh no. Wow. One three flying vigilance. Whenever I surveil, put one one counter on my commander. At the beginning of my end step, I may return target creature card with less power than Urko from my graveyard to the battlefield with the finality counter, which means once it dies, it will be exiled. It's kinda cool that they you may go. reprinted Reliquary Tower. It's a pretty awesome reprint. <laughs> we'll say that. 
I do like Thanks, that Wizards. Card. It's handy. Hopefully, I get to draw cards and make handy it useful. Handy. Very much so. I will play a planes. Let's see. Just a basic plain old planes. <laughs> hmm. I feel very behind already. I did too, and then I was like, oh, my commander cost That's, three. Yeah. Yay. That's scary. <laughs> I will pay two for or three for oh. smuggler's share. Oh, At the beginning of each shit. end step, draw a card for each opponent who drew two or more cards this turn. <gasps> then create oh, a treasure a token <laughs> for each opponent who had two or more lands enter the battlefield under their control this turn. So good. That's, That's almost like they planned that. Yeah. yeah. These pre-cons are. So good. <laughs> right, we plan on drawing a lot of cards, so you, you might do? be able to. That's good. Yeah. Yeah, that's <laughs> why these are in the deck because we probably will have draw cards in here. It's good. It's good news. <laughs> I remember when we did the Wilds of Eldraine precon. You can go check that out for uh, in our backlog for the low, low price of it. It was wild. <laughs> <laughs> nine ninety nine ninety nine, but for you free. <laughs> so you have a two two, Ken? Yes. Yes. <laughs> I have a one three. <laughs> Want to see something funny? You're going to attack oh, me anyway? No. I'm going to attack Ken with a 2-4 Vigilance. Uh, whenever Nelly Borka attacks suspect target creature. Oh, no. Mm. Oh. Then goad all suspected creatures. So I just can't attack you with it. Yeah. OK. Still pretty good. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Yeah. That's... <laughs> I'll have to look for a goad token. I'm going to do something Here, it's unlocked. surprising. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to take the two. Oh, that's not very surprising. Two commander. Two commander. Good, so you want a fish bead? No. Okay. Because Ken's got these that I could write the real word on. Yep. Fair enough. That's why we got those infinite tokens. Here you go. <laughs> They're infinite. I love them. They're the best. All right. Now he is a goat. So uh, that ends that. I'm going to do the imitation. <laughs> All righty, Dan. Guess I'll untap and draw. Fun stuff. Uh, I'll replay my Shrine with the Forsaken Gods. Then I will cast Welcoming Vampire. Ooh. Two, well, three, flying. Hey, guys. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Whenever one or more other creatures with power two or less enters the battlefield under my control, draw a card. card Ability so triggers good. only one each, once each turn. All right, give it to that's another bomb reprieve yeah, right I, there. I, I love that card. See, like, awesome, awesome. I, I wish it was in say, here, but it's white. You can never say relic where you're talking about. Yeah, it's just glossing over uh, the bomb. Oh, well, it's just, yeah. So it's going to get bigger eventually. Yeah. Maybe play Greenland, do you mind? <laughs> yeah. Greenland, Go ahead. Greenland. Okay. <laughs> Untap. And I will draw. But well, we're going. We don't need green mana. Turn. I do. We play one. <laughs> well, I will play this island. <gasps> what? Mm. I don't know how to do the Tim Allen grab. Huh? <laughs> Shoot. No, I'm just kind of. No, I was playing at something else. Without uh, green. I was going to call every artifact I put out the. So everybody's got 100. Some. Everybody's got some. <laughs> Sorry, I'm reading cards. Um, I'm just going to hold because this is just a dinky 2 2 right now, and I cannot. If you're not going to block with it, you might as well attack with it. Right. You're goaded. He's got a 2 3. He's got a 2 4. Yeah, the good thing about my goat is vigilant. So <laughs> even if I attack, everything is still block. currently has more toughness than yeah. the germ. So size wise, you would mm. kill it. You would kill mm. it. He won't. But I, I'm just going to hold back right now. He's holding. Pass. Fair, fair, fair. Okay. And tap, draw. I will play this island. Come on, play it. What do you need? <laughs> you don't have words. <laughs> no, I don't. It's this guy that needs to play for it. That's why I'm confused. It's messing around. All right, so but now I can copy it. Two, two. <laughs> and then I got one for two, and one for three, and two, and three. Okay, I'll do that. I'm going to pay two for the Demir Signet. I could pay one into it to tap for blue and black. I'm going to attempt to do a couple of things here. Um, I'm going to pay one into the Signet for blue and black, and I'm going to use that to play Copy Catchers. It's a 2-1 Flying Fairy, and whenever I surveil, I may pay two if I do create a token that's a copy of Copy Catchers. <laughs> Obviously, I won't be able to do that this particular time, but I'm also going to spend my last mana to pay for Otherworldly Gaze. It is an instant, but I'm doing it now. Uh, I get to surveil three 
look at the top three cards in my library and then put any number of them into my graveyard and the rest on the top in any order. Mm. Seems like your deck is playing the way it should be. <laughs> Man, this is interesting. I am not get rid of any of these, so I'm gonna actually just do that. And whenever I surveil, I put a 1-1 counter on my commander. Oh god. So it is now a 2-4. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, and then this also has flashback, so I can pay two to cast it from my graveyard and then exile it afterwards. I did not. I do not have the two mana to pay to copy my copy catchers to make another copy of copy catchers. So I'll do that some other time, maybe. Oops. Why would you want to copy your copy catchers? Because then it's going to get confusing to keep up with <laughs> all the other surveilling. <laughs> but I'm assuming that's why it's like that. Okay, so I am goaded. But I'm also vigilant, so that is okay by me. Eesh. I have to attack either Ken or Chris. Ken has damage on him. That flies, though, correct? Yep. yep. How yes. big is it? 2-3. Oh. I'm the easiest target okay. here. This is a 2-4, so I don't know if Chris will block. Oh. Mm. I will go ahead and attack you with a 2-4 with my commander, Chris. Worker's just a 2-4? Why yeah. wouldn't he block? Hmm. Yes. Because then his creature would die and you would get no value out of it. You're only doing two damage on him. My, my creature's a 2-3. Two two three. Three. I know. And you're doing Do you how much damage? damage? It's a 2-4. I'm saying it wouldn't kill this. Oh, that's what, okay. Oh. That's all I was getting at. Right, right okay. I, I see what you're doing. Sure, I'll block. Okay. That's mean. That's a vampire crank. <laughs> Why don't you want cards? <laughs> <laughs> Literally. Because it helps you. Yeah, all right. Straight <laughs> to prevent. <sighs> Untap. Well, I assume you're done, right? Mm -hmm. Draw. When does Marco trigger again? Oh, uh, getting in my end step, I can return target creature card power less than him from the graveyard to the battlefield. Okay. Oh, and... it's less than, not less than or equal. Got yeah, it. I think. Let's cool. see here. It says less than. Yep, so I can't do that yet. Cool. Doggo is not big enough. No, it's a 2 1. All right, I'm gonna pay one, two, three, four. Oh, wait a minute. You suspected this? Yeah. Okay, so a suspected creature has moved. Oh, whoops. Oh, oh so yeah, the damage does up. get through. Okay. Oh, oh. Sorry about that. It's again, new. Again, it's new. Again, yeah. this is the first time I'm doing this. It oh, was that's fair. suspected, I, and I didn't, I didn't read into suspected at all because I don't think my deck does it. So. Uh, and I can't block, so vigilant is actually is yeah, relevant, relevant to me. So, um, so yeah, so so two commander to you. Yep. And then that does what now? Uh, all right. <clears throat> Whenever one or more creatures an opponent controls deals combat damage to one or more of your opponents, you and the controller of those creatures each draw a card. Okay. Oh wow! Sorry for the rewind, folks. That's yeah, why we okay. play these, so everyone now, gets used to the term. At the beginning of each end step, draw a card for each opponent who drew two or more cards this turn. Then create a treasure token for each opponent had two or more lands enter the battlefield under the control this turn. You get the first part. Yeah. Yep. So, part one. Bam. Okay. Wow. Now we're back on track again. That's why we do this, so we could all learn together. Interesting. Friendship. Okay. <laughs> all right. Now take your turn. Yep. Filthy animal. <laughs> <laughs> it hurts. I'm just kidding. You got me a card. That was cool. Yeah. You tried to avoid that for some reason. I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> I'm trying to grasp the terms in my deck, and then I'm. That's why I missed the stuff that you're doing. All right. Well, I untapped. I will play planes. I will pay two for a thought vessel. Hmm. I have no maximum hand size, and I can tap it for a mana. Nice. We all have no then, maximum hand size. Except me. Except so Chris. <laughs> <laughs> the guy that One day. The cards in the hand. Yeah. <laughs> One card in the hand is worth two in the bush. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> right. Nobody does. Get out I'm of my head, I'm just going to move on. Get out of my head. <laughs> all right, I'm going to pay four. For trouble in pairs, Ooh. if an opponent would begin an extra turn, that player skips that turn instead. Whenever an opponent attacks me with two or more creatures, draws their second card each turn, or casts their second spell each turn, I draw a card. Dang, wow. you're gonna be drawing a lot of cards. Yeah, yeah. that's why I needed mark, that thought. Mark white and red. Mark so we the remember heck? the triggers. <laughs> I don't know how to mark them. Oh, okay. Here, you're giving white way too much drawing power. <laughs> we wanted that. Now I want it gone. <laughs> <laughs> All right. 
Let's see. You have a blocker. A 2-1 blocker only in the air. Hmm. I think in order to spread the damage around nicely, I'm going to send Nelly Borka at you. Okay. So it's a 2-4 Vigilance. Okay. But then I am going to suspect Chris's vampire. I had a fuel. So and I'm going to goad it. I'm going to take yep. two commander from Dan. Question. Yeah. Did his goad go away on this? It yeah. did, but it just came back. Okay. So you're goading this one again. Uh, or did you go to this? Whenever one or. Oh, I'm sorry. Suspect and go. Whenever to Nelly Borka things. Impulsive Accuser attacks, suspect target creature. Okay. Then goad all suspected creatures. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So okay. it's on top of. They're always so going to be suspected, but then they get goaded each time. It, it, yeah, I want to continue to add to the suspected pool so that oh way my. you guys continue fighting to death. That's a, definitely a new angle at like a battle ready commander rather than doing what they usually do. Put a bunch of equipments on there and just attack, and that's the game. It's like it, it, it puts a different spin on Boros. Mm. Yeah, a lot keeps of it aggressive, out. but it keeps forces everybody else to be aggressive too. Well, yeah, yeah. Anyways, that's my turn. All right, I will untap, draw for turn. My whole plan of keeping Ken off green this whole game is work going well. You have green in there? Yeah, supposedly. It's part of the commander's. Yeah, uh, it's, it's green, there. and then it's a hybrid. Uh, or so it's neither the, one of you have green. It's but there green. somewhere. <laughs> I have green in the deck. All right, I'm gonna <laughs> cast a morph creature. What is it? It's a morph. <laughs> go go, Power Ranger. Uh, creature power two less enter the battlefield, so I get to draw a card from my welcoming vampire. Oh look, a land. I'll play Fortified Village. Uh, there's tapped. Unless I reveal a forest or plains in my hand, I will not reveal. So that's there, and Why I have to go pop it. Well, Sweet. No, maybe I want to keep my secrets. Maybe I don't have them in hand. You don't know. It's for you're the detective. We're all detectives. All right, we're just all bad at it right now. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, detect who I'm attacking now. Oh man. It's Ken. Yay! Really? <laughs> yeah, it yeah, flies, and he doesn't so, want it to die. Oh. Okay. Good point. Well, can't, Vince can't block. Any this is fine. Menace. Oh, good, oh point. good point. Yeah. I forgot that already. Yeah. I, I forgot that too. So. It's been like 20 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, we're all very bad detectives. <laughs> <laughs> he could be the killer. He was over there. <laughs> no. <laughs> nah. Well, He's holding a knife. <laughs> he walked in 20 seconds ago. <laughs> well, I took it. So. Yep. And we go to the end step, and Dan has some triggers. It's like... No, no, not at the end step. Whenever one or more creatures an opponent controls deals combat damage to one or more of your opponents, you and the controller of those creatures oh, each okay. draw a card. Don't you do... Wait, didn't... So I drew from this effect. Yeah, okay. I might That's sure you... why I was saying that. Yeah, I made right. sure you Now got we're that. drawing from Dan's effect, and now we go to the end step. And, and now I Dan, get to draw again. You're triggering on the smugglers? Uh, yes, smuggler share triggers. And... The... And let's see, draws their second card, so I should have drawn then. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, all right. right. Well, damn, the value. Damn. Damn. Is there no removal myself. in these decks? Like, come on, guy. <laughs> it's pre con. It's pre con. That's, That's usually a lot of. This is only turn four. <laughs> it is? Yeah, go ahead, kid. All righty. Not untap. Draw. <laughs> Interesting. I Feels will like play... it's been longer. I will play a planes. Now it's turn five. Uh, with that, I... okay. Um, so since Chris has green, so there's way green. That eh, I welcome. Cast my commander, who uh, is a merfolk fish detective. <laughs> no maximum hand size at the beginning of your upkeep. Investigate. I'll make sure I mark that in a minute here. Uh, whenever you draw your second card each turn, put two 1-1 one, one counters on him. Ooh. Uh, now I will... Oh, shoot. That doesn't work. <laughs> Thought I was going to do something else. That is not going to happen. All right. Shoot. It's okay. Dan's going to ride this value train for sure. Yeah. As long as he can. I don't have enough green. I was about to yeah. do something else, so that's not going to happen. But you have your commander? Yes, I do. I do. So I guess I'll have to do what I was going to do next turn. So... But shoot, Dan's on a... Ignore me! <laughs> That's a 2-4. I will lose my germ. Doss would die. 
Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna hold, pass, mark my stuff so I know what I'm doing. On tap, I don't know what I'm doing. Draw. That is good. I'll You're improvising? Swamp? In the artifact deck? No. I don't believe it. I'm gonna pay two and exile my otherworldly gaze. I'm gonna cast it from my graveyard. So I'm gonna surveil three again, which is gonna give a one one counter on my creature. One, two, three. Oh, that's interesting. I'm gonna put the sinister starfish in my graveyard. It's a zero three. Very sinister. <laughs> well, I'll, friend, friend I'll, I'll get it in my end step because it has less is it chocolate Maybe. ah he said it <laughs> right, I knew somebody would <laughs> I don't get the double entendre <laughs> whenever I surveil I may pay two if I do create a token that's a copy of copy catchers I'm going to do that <gasps> should have gone with picture copying copy catchers ding oh that's a copy of uh, of them. a copy. Okay. Mm, that changes things now because are they in a cup? Yeah, copy copy cup. <laughs> All right, so I have to attack with this. Yep. Yeah, Chris only has one creature he can block with. I know. Well, yeah, it's flying. All, it's flying, flying also. Yeah. So, um, I attacked Chris with it last time. I guess I'll attack you, Ken. So it's a three, five. Uh, my commander. <sighs> Bonk, bonk, bonk. Yep. And we draw cards. Triggers, draw a card. Then I draw a card. Okay, that doesn't help. Why can't I draw a card? <laughs> so, I'll go to you next. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I see that I'm card. gonna go to my end step, beginning of my end step, return target creature card with power less than Merkos from the graveyard to the battlefield with the finality counter I will bring the Sinister Starfish out. It's a 0-3 and it has Surveil 1. I also draw a card because you went to your end step. Yes, sir. After drawing two cards. Finality uh, counter. I know we're going to run out of those, so I figure I'll... <laughs> Go ahead, dude. Hang on, i got to read all the cards I drew. <laughs> Do that during your I actually meant key. to bring my Finality Counters from the uh, Lost Caverns of Ixalan pre oh. I, was, uh, I was like, oh, these are kind of handy, actually. So they brought it back. In this one card. <laughs> <clears throat> okay. I will pay three, four, I'll play a mountain, five, four. Right of the Raging Storm. It's oh. an enchantment. Creatures named Lightning Rager can't attack me or planeswalkers I control. At the beginning of each player's upkeep, that player creates a 5-1 red elemental creature token named Lightning Rager. It has Shample, Haste, and at the beginning of the end step, sacrifice this creature. So you be raging. Yeah. Glow sticks and all. The raging Cajun. <laughs> Precisely correct. <laughs> all right. All right. Who let the dogs out? Who? That's a who. <laughs> Let's uh, keep going with a Tome of Legends. Ooh. Artifact. Tome of Legends enters the battlefield with a page counter on it. Uh, bam. Whenever your commander enters the battlefield or attacks, put a page counter on Tome of Legends. Pay one, tap, remove a page counter from Tome of Legends, draw a card. All right. Sweet. Let's see. All right, I will... Attack Chris with Nelly Borka. Vigilance 2 4. I don't believe it. Or whatever it attacks. <laughs> Borka, Borka, Borka. Go uh, suspect target creature. Uh, let's suspect that one. You got a token thingy? Or a what one? Of course I have a token thingy. There we go. His commander. Bam. Let's and go. it's goaded. Yeah. Stop doing that to the commanders for commander ooh, damage. Goaded. Did you take two? Yes, I did. To make a thing go right? Yep. Yeah. All right. <laughs> I don't get to draw cards on my turn. You can if you attack. Deck, deck, deck. What? No, it's uh, whenever an opponent's creature deals damage to an opponent. Oh. So I just because I dealt damage, I don't get a, to draw a card. Yeah, Dan wants us to punch each other yeah. so he can get cards. But he has to punch us first Yeah. because he suspects us. Yeah, it was you. <laughs> All right. Uh, I, mean, I mean, I am among us. Oh, I attacked, so that's got to go up. And I think that is all I will be doing. 
Mm -hmm. All right, cool. Guess I'll untap on the upkeep. Dan's gonna give me a uh, lightning rager. Where'd that uh, Infinitogen go? <laughs> this should, should be in your yeah, stack. Yeah, tokens, Dan. Should be in your stack. Oh, that's no fun. <laughs> well, we gotta pass it around. No, there's only soldiers and gold in here. Okay. Monarch? You're telling me there's Monarch in this deck? Oh, yeah. Well, that's cool. Like, I need more you card have, draw? You should have four of those. No, because they four go, monarchs. They go away at the end of turn. So oh, okay. Yeah, so then I give it to you. You give yeah, it to Vince. Hand it around when you end your turn. Take one down, hand it around. Speaking of, I'll draw for turn. But what will Ken post to his Instagram account? All right, I'm going to play this Crows and Verge. And there's play tapped. Tap for colorless. I can also pay two, tap, and sacrifice it to search my library for a forest card and a plains card. Put them onto the battlefield tapped, then shuffle. Cronenberg? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe, but less suggestive. Uh, well, I can finally do this, so I'm gonna go green. Always doing it. Let's go white, and I'll have a red mana floating, so I can cast my commander. Mm. Yay! Um, yeah, for you. Yeah, finally, after six turns. We're going on He's counting. <laughs> All right, Cow Sty of the Glade. Never a feature I control that was turned face up this turn. Deals combat damage to a player. Draw a card. Tap, turn target face down. Attack creature you control face up. No haste, so that doesn't help me much. I'm fine with it. I'm sure you are. <laughs> All right, I'll use the red that was floating and a mana from Shrine of the Forsaken Gods to play a disguise creature. Who this what guy? could it be? It's a mysterious creature. Alright, so it's a 2-2. Two -two. Uh, it also has Ward 2, so that's what distinguishes a disguised or cloaked creature from a morph creature. Mm, good point. Yeah, mm. it's pretty neat. It's actually relevant to me. It's not Ward 2. Yeah, and because it's a... Actually, I should have drawn it off my commander. I'll draw a card with Welcoming Vampire, thus Yay. triggering Dan's enchantment. Look at you go, Which, Dan. Why did you draw a card? Whenever one or more other creatures with power two or less ah. enters the battlefield under my control, my gotcha. commander has two power. And then that was the uh, smugglers. Uh, no, that was the. Uh, oh, you drew off your commander. Trouble in pairs. No, yeah. no, I drew off my welcoming vampire from me, right. my commander. And what about the uh, morph? I don't because this only triggers once each turn. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yep. Right. And I gotta go combat because one of my things is goaded, and I have a lightning ranger that I'm surely gonna do something with. Go, go, lightning ranger. And can't attack you with it, right, Dan? Correct. Cool. I right. try. I could try, but I will probably fail. Uh, ooh, Vince has those copies in the air. So I guess welcoming vampire will go at Ken for two in the air, and the lightning ranger will go at Vince. Five one trample. Yeah. Really? See? Okay. I'm spread the, spread the love. Let's oh, see. yeah. It was smart because uh, it's menace and it can't. Oh, you can't play it. Okay, I'm thinking fear. Guess what? Yeah, we get to draw cards. <gasps> we do. Sweet triggers. I like it. Oh no, I have too many cards in hand, and I don't have a maximum. Hand. <laughs> or, I, I don't have a maximum hand size increasing effect. Well, I have double, so I'm allowed to have double the cards. For shame. <laughs> yeah, it, it really is. Uh, so I go to my end step. I gotta discard one of these cards. I'm not gonna need this piece for Whisperer. Oh, you moved to your end step? I yeah. can draw a card again. Yippers. Draw You're wearing a what? Again. Pullover? <laughs> go ahead, Ken. All right. Untap. Trigger. At the beginning of my upkeep, I get to investigate. So I create a clue token, which has tap, uh, two, sacrifice a artifact or a card. Hey, that goes up now. Yep. Look, a lightning ranger. So there's that. Okay. Sure get everything. Hey, that's my thing. It's now, morphin' time. Now I get to draw. I'm gonna tap the idol oblivion and I'll draw a card. Activate only if you created a token this turn, which I did. So draw. Okay. Feels a little better. Um, for land, I'll play a prairie stream. Uh, enters the battlefield tapped unless you control two or more basic lands, which I do. Well, aren't you fortunate? I am. Uh, whenever you draw your second card, which I did, 
each turn put two 1-1 one -one counters on Morska. So right now it's got two 1-1 one -one counters. So now it's a 4-5. And he's goaded. Neat. Um, I'm going to tap the Exotic Orchard for a green. And I will, um, I will evoke this uh, wave, wave Sifter. So, flying, uh, when wave scissor en yeah. sifter enters the battlefield, uh, investigate twice. So, I would have uh, two more tokens enter. So, I'll have three clues. You got a clue. And this goes a three. So, this is now a five five. Dan, or uh, Ken, did you draw with the uh, Idol of Oblivion already this turn? Yes. yes. That's Dan, why it's did you draw your card? I did not. Yeah. All right. So I'm going to uh, back to the wave sifter. <laughs> uh, it investigates twice. That was two more. Okay. I yep. evoked it, so I paid a blue and whoops. You saw that? All right. I paid a blue and a green. I may cast a spell for its evoke cause. If you do, it's sacrificed when it enters the battlefield. So immediately goes there. Bye, Wave Sifter. Bye. See you in the next one. Uh, since... Does that only happen once each turn, or do you do... Yeah, that's... Uh, the Smuggler's Share is once a turn. Well, I'm talking about the pairs. Trouble in Pairs also is once a turn. Okay, cool. Now I'm going to pay four in total. I'm going to sacrifice uh, two of my clue tokens, and I'll draw two more cards. And that gets smaller. Yeah. So we're down to three. Okay. Um, so now I must attack with my commander, and I must attack with this Lightning Ranger. False. You don't have to attack with the Lightning Ranger. Well, oh. How but, but you probably should. May I? Yeah, it's Trample, Haste, they're goaded, I thought. But okay. No. The, the Lightning Ranger is not goaded. Okay. Yeah, it, just, it just can't, just can't attack, attack Dan. Dan. Yep. Yeah. Gotcha. But it has trample and haste, and let's move things along. Uh, so lightning ranger at Vince, and then my commander <laughs> at uh, Chris. So it's a four, four, five. Sure, I'll take it. Wow. Okay. Hey, we get to draw cards. A Sweet. Card. Nine. I will hold these cards in my hand, <laughs> and I will pass the turn. At your end step, I get to draw a card. To Vince. On tap, on tap, on tap, on tap, draw. How many cards do you have in hand now, Dan? <laughs> I've all wasn't them. counting. <laughs> He's got an island. Fourteen. Looks like he's going to value town. I'm pretty sure I'm going to deck myself this game. <laughs> That you guys be better die soon. <laughs> On our way, you're still at 40, so... <laughs> That's fine. Ignore me. No. Right, I'm going to tap this to surveil one, which gives another counter to my commander. Surveil one, two, three, two, three. I'll put the Twilight Prophet in my graveyard, because... Twilight Prophet got a reprint? Sweet. Yeah, that can stay there. That's a good card. What else can I do that surveils in my hand? Just pass. <laughs> you can't. <laughs> you have to answer to the goad. Kind of want to get rid of Dan's commander, but I'd be fine with it. I actually hate this more. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. Have a lightning ranger. Go, go, lightning ranger. <laughs> um. I love how we made oh. a big deal about passing the lightning ranger around, and then we all forgot to pass the lightning ranger. I around. will. I didn't pay two. <laughs> When I did the surveil, so I created a copy of my copy catchers because because they kept catching copies. Because <laughs> then this will cost less. I'm gonna play pile on and destroy <laughs> your commander, Dan. Oh, uh, so it's convoke. That's why I tapped two creatures to pay for two mana. Cool. And then I paid two, destroy target creature planes, and I get to surveil two. So wow. my commander will go up again. Surveil two more. Oy, oy, oy. Actually, kind of like these. Those are going to stay there. Um, and then I. You've only drawn one card, correct? 
Yes. Okay. And I surveilled again, so I gotta see if I wanna do anything else or do I wanna pay two to make another copy of the copy character. That's crazy. You can keep it up. And one and that is two. Just do a card three. saying once each turn. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna do that because it just makes more sense. That's since crazy. I don't have to get rid of any of this stuff right now. All right, so now I have to go to attacks, and uh, I'll send the five one ranger at you, and my commander five in the air at you. Ugh. This is getting messy. <laughs> And you said two at me? Yeah. Yep, sorry. Ooh. And then I do not have any other place. So, uh, beginning of my end step, I may return to the creature card, power less than uh, Mirko from my graveyard to the battlefield with a finality counter. I think I'm going to bring Twilight Prophet. Nice. Uh -oh. So, Twilight Prophet has Ascend. If I have ten or more permanents, which is see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eight, yes, I do. <laughs> so, I have the City's Blessing at the beginning of my upkeep. If I have the City's Blessing, I reveal the top card of my library, put it in my hand. Each opponent loses X life, and I gain uh, X life where X is the card's mana value. Oh! So, there's City's Blessing. He is murdering. <laughs> see? It's all part of Dan's plan. City, oh, the very almost the last one. Yay, City's blessing. All right, so all right, that you was that. Permit. You get that. Actually, Yay. Uh, this has a finality counter on it as well, though, so that's okay. All right. All right. Did you draw for a smuggler share at the end of Vince's turn, Dan? Did he draw another card? No. Did you hit me? Oh, that's right. I was supposed to. Yeah. No. Because he destroyed my commander. Oh, that's right. Never mind. Right. Oh. Yeah, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I'm so used to Dan drawing. I know. So I know. I, I'm used to it. There's too. a lot that's going on. I noticed I didn't. <laughs> I was sad. Good point. <laughs> An access tunnel. Never die, detective. Was it access tunnel? Uh, access tunnel. Tap for one colorless or pay three. Tap target creature with power three or less. Cannot be blocked this turn. All right. So two, three. Four, five, six. Oh, yay, Nelly's back. Damn it. Dang it. Two, because Nelly is back, whenever you cast your commander or one of your commander enters the battlefield or attacks, put a page counter on, so three. All right, I've got a lightning rager. Uh, congratulations, Vince, you're currently in the lead. Five, one. <laughs> I'll block with this ding dong. Yay! Ding, ding, yeah. ding. Oh, I had to. I took 10 already from that stupid thing. Yeah, well. Did you take your damage? <laughs> it's trampled. Oh, that's right. Then never mind. Oh. Because you're blocking one makes no you sense. You can't. Can you block with your commander? No. Nope. Oh. Suspected creatures oh, yeah. can't block. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Grab more. All right. All right. I assume by the passing of the Lightning Ranger, you passed your turn as well, Dan? Yes. Okay. Right, one Good tap. guess. <laughs> Upkeep. I get the Lightning Ranger. I'll draw for turn. That's a cool card. Yeah, uh, cool card. It doesn't change. In fact, changes it what I want to do this turn. But that is a pretty cool card. Um, all right. I'm gonna play a Cinder Blade. Uh, enters play tap plus I control two or more basic lands, which I control zero basics. Wow. Yay. <laughs> yes. Yep. Sad is is what it is. In the meantime, I will cast Sidar Kondo of Jamura. Oh, is it a fun one? Yeah. The condos are in southern Florida. Yes. <laughs> uh, Human Knight 2-5 with flanking. Whenever a creature without flanking blocks this creature, the blocking creature gets minus one, minus one until end of turn. But more importantly, creatures my opponents control without flying or reach can't block creatures with power two or less. Mm. And lucky for me, my wharf creatures are power two or less. <laughs> And speaking of, Sadar Kondo's power is two, so I do get to draw a card from Welcome the Vampire. Which means... Yay. Dang, oh, it's a draw it's card. card draw is out of control. I know, right? <laughs> yeah, I'll be not one yet. A bounty of, of <laughs> card draw this time. It's it's amazing. Usually everybody's like, oh, I don't have any cards. Vince is running out of cards by now. Hmm? But not this time. Hmm. <sighs> no, sir, I don't like... Decisions, it. decisions. Now I have to think about what I'm going to do. <laughs> 
<laughs> well, I do know the main thing I want to do. It's just what else do I want to do on top of it with this Lightning Ranger in specific? All right, I guess so, I guess we could spread the love around. So this Morph Creature, Lightning Ranger, and Welcoming Vampire. Oh yeah, this can't bl be blocked either. I guess the Mysterious Creature can also attack. But who? Uh, a real mystery. Welcoming Vampire and a Mysterious Creature will attack Vince for four total. The Lightning Ranger will go at Ken for five. Then this Morph Creature is going at Dan. Mm -hmm. And before damage, I'm going to use Kaust's ability to turn target face down, attack a creature I control face up. Uh oh, I'm gonna oh do I was this wondering more. how that was going to Yeah, happen. and I'm going to reveal this Frozen Cloud Scraper. Holy. Which is a 13 13. <laughs> I was wondering why you didn't attack more for him. Like, dude, he's at 38. You're attacking him for 2 2, you dingus. <laughs> uh, what else does he do? Uh, at the beginning of my upkeep, I have to sacrifice him unless I pay 2 green. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> wow. All I right. really wish I had another mana open. So, go ahead first. He's attacking how many to him? A five. five, one. Yeah. Um, It'll go faster if you just take it like I've been. <laughs> take it. Uh, either take it or I kill this Frixian and only take two. Try to stay in this, stay afloat. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to block with this uh, germ and I'll lose two life. So mm -hmm. germ will die. Yep. The mm -hmm. nettle cyst will just hang out. And what are you taking out? A 2 2 and a 2 3? Yeah, so you. Yeah, so I think the only thing you can actually block is the mysterious creature since I got menace with. Oh, good point. Yeah, yeah. I, I will Empire. take two. I, I will block the other two though. Okay. This is a two-one. Okay, that's fine. I lose my print lifter ooze. Mm. I take thirteen. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I'm specifically flipping this after the point where Dan can declare blockers. So. I gotcha. Yeah. Uh. uh all right, you dealt damage to my opponents. I we did. each get to draw a card. That's pretty neat. I don't like it. Oh, I drew a card, Dan. <laughs> yeah, so I get to draw another card at your end step. Is it your end step? Wait, did you draw another card now? Oh, wait. Just now? I drew another card. Oh, you drew your second card, so I get to draw one. Mm -hmm. Right, I have to draw another card because this got flipped up this turn. And that's what my commander says. <laughs> Jeez, man, where's your uh, reliquary tower, Chris? <laughs> Uh, I can't find it, apparently. <laughs> I took it out. <laughs> that would be I mean, he's got two things that give him no magic hand size for Christ's sake. Catch up! I want to borrow it! <laughs> you going to your end step? Yeah. I get to draw. <laughs> I gotta figure out what I'm keeping in. <laughs> it's like, what do you have to die? Because I'm down to two cards. <laughs> uh, I'm definitely discarding wild growth and uh, kind of agonizing over this last one, but I guess I'll get rid of... Agonize. <laughs> oh, that's pretty cool. Okay, I, I I guess I'll lose Mossfire Valley since I'm drawing so many cards. Go. I had Ken with your Lightning Ranger. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Untap everything. <laughs> there you go. Not just the select ones. Yeah. Trigger. At the beginning of my upkeep, I get to investigate. So now I have two clues. And you. Never mind. Yeah. Draw. <laughs> But you get to do that. Yeah. Uh, let's... For my land, I'll play a Temple of Mystery. Enters Battlefield tap. Uh, when it enters Battlefield, scry one. Mm. Yeah, because that's kind of where I need to be. Um, mm. So many cool things in my mm. hand. Uh, all right, I'm going to pay four. Four. And I will play Adrix and Nev Twincasters. Hey, I like oh, those guys. Oh, shoot. Tap Ward two. Which means you gotta do anything to them, you gotta pay two. If one or more tokens would be created under your control, twice that many tokens are created instead. Yikes. I will pay two. And I will attach the nettle cyst to my commander. Oh, buckets. So, um, for anything, I will tap this to draw a card because the token was created this turn. So it gets plus four, plus four currently? Yeah, because that's one, two, three, four. And whenever you draw your second card, which I just did, so he gets another two, so he's a, that's plus four on him boy, for his own boy, ability. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. So he's a... Because he gets plus one, plus one for each artifact you, you control. So he's a 10. Yeah, he's up there. Question is, where do I go with him? Because he has Menace. 
Mm. Oh, suspected creature. Yep. Yeah, he's, he's suspected. Um, but I'm out of mana, so it kind of is going to leave me in a spot, but that's fine. I don't, we got to move this along. Hmm. Do we feel like Dan's quelled? <laughs> he has so many cards in hand, it's hard to tell. Yeah, he's got I don't like the three mana up. So. Me and Vince are at the lowest. So, I mean, you can right. basically attack anybody. Everybody's open with this. This is man. true. Chris, I'm attacking you with the um, Rager. Lightning Rager. Do, 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 do. <laughs> then Dan, I'm I will form swing at you for lightning. 10 with my oh, commander. Shit. Just a huge okay. bullet there. Menace, so. Is that all? Is everything it uh, declared? Yes. Yep. Oh, God. <laughs> Shoot. <laughs> nice, nice. Oh, you're not blocking it? No. Okay. And I am... No, you're not doing anything, or... <laughs> I, I didn't do <laughs> anything! <laughs> well, no, you're Leave like, me alone! He was no. moving his dice and no, his... No, you were just like... You haven't activated his trap card yet. Okay. You said, is everything declared, and it's like... I just wanted to know if that was everything! Good God! Three mana up, it's a little, you know... You got 27 cards in your hand, he was just a little curious, that's all. Yeah, you, you gotta understand. <laughs> Please understand. That, <laughs> Jesus. I will remove the glasses, I will pass the lightning ranger, and... Go ahead, Vince. All right, I'll untap my things. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> After I untap my things, I got two. At the beginning of my upkeep, if I have the city's blessing, reveal the top card of my library. Oh, of course. Something that costs one mana. <laughs> hey, Ken, did you only draw one card last turn? I drew two. Oh. Oh, sorry, yeah. Um, if I have the city's blessing, reveal it and put it in my hand. Each opponent loses X life and I gain X life where X is the mana value. Hey, everyone loses one and I gain Ooh. one. All right. such, a, such a huge value. <coughs> you in the value train. I mean, he's moving it along. Huge, huge value. Uh, I will play this swamp for my land for turn. I will pay. So one to play consider, which surveils one. So this goes up another one. Dink. I will surveil one. Do I want that there? Hmm. Yeah, sure, why not? And then I draw a card. Haha, that's the one I was just looking at. Uh, and then I will tap this to surveil one. So this goes up again. I will now. Yeah, they can stay there. <laughs> All right, I, yeah, yeah. Because I'm well, currently scared of two creatures on the board, and I can this, do something to one of them. And this is scary. Yes, it's very scary. Definitely. Right. Ah, but I left you alone. Ha ha ha! Politicking. Ha ha ha! No. And I'm gonna pay <laughs> one for ransom note. When enters the battlefield, surveil one. So this is gonna go up again. Oh boy. Now look at that card I already looked at, so that goes back, because I don't want to put it in the graveyard. Um, and then basically what Ransom Note is, is when enters a battlefield, surveil one, and then I could pay two to sacrifice it to choose one. Uh, cloak the top card of my library. I don't know what that means. Uh, <laughs> go target creature, which is why I say, you know, gotcha. or draw a card, because maybe I don't want to get attacked by something huge. So yeah. I can also save that and sacrifice it. Would it help if you know what Cloak does? I still think I want to go to one of either that big creature or that big creature. I can do okay. that any time. Okay. Yes. Gotcha. So I can wait till someone attacks yeah. me before I even do it. But yes, I would like to know what it means if you don't mind sharing. Yeah, so when you cloak when you cloak a creature, basically it becomes a mysterious creature. So now it's it's cloaked. Oh, so um, it's like morph, like what you did. There. Yeah, but a, diff a different card effect is making the creature face down. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, I surveilled three times this turn, um, and I should probably pay to make copies because I might need them for blocking. Well, I'll say you could, you could attack with one, two creatures two, per player right now. One, two. I was at, I'm at least going to make two more of the copies where the bad boys go. Well, they're not good. All right. They're bad. Did they give me any more copies? Yeah, you do. Nice. So those are the just two enough. that just came in, right? Uh, yeah, flying is going to be my go-to here, it seems. I think I just need to tap some things and see what happens here. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, a um, bold move, Cotton. Sorry. <laughs> Let's see if it pays off. Sorry, Ken, it makes the most sense to yeah. attack you with my commander, because you got the most commander damage from me. Seven? Or uh, eight. Eight, okay. Uh, and then 
Chris, I'll tech you with the five one guy. Yep. And Dan, I'll tech you with two in the uh, four in the air flying, a two four and a two one. Ooh, that might just get me there. <laughs> one more tech and and. Should I do any of this stuff here? How much mana do I have? Left? Do you draw any cards? No. No. Uh, you like, should draw a card. Is that thing still Whenever one or more creatures an opponent controls deals combat to one or more of my opponents. Okay, that's still... So, okay, yes, then I do draw them for that. Um, that is no help. <laughs> uh, Ooh, ain't no help. Yeah, <laughs> Nelly is going downtown, baby. <laughs> what? <laughs> Right. I was trying to reference the Nelly song there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it is getting hot in here. I am going to <laughs> move to I'm my... I'm not going to take off all my clothes. Oh, <laughs> end step. <laughs> uh, beginning of my end step, I may return to our creature card power less than him to the battlefield. Oh, you attack me with two creatures. Correct. All right. Whenever an opponent attacks me with one or more creatures, or with two or more creatures, draw, draws their second card, or... All right, so it's... Or. or yeah. So it only yeah. triggers once. Right. So I'm bringing back the Dogged Detective. When Dogged yeah, Detective yeah. enters the battle, Field surveil two, but I do draw a card because of smuggler's share. That guy's cool. Surveilling two. Whoa, yeah, those are still in there. Wait, woof woof. Indeed. Actually, I could put this in the graveyard because then I just get it for free. I wouldn't have to pay. But then everyone would see what it is. Why is it with this set? I feel like New Capenna and uh, Ravnica went. <laughs> that is what it feels it's, like. Yeah, it's very noir. Still, I'm fine with which it. Which is I cool. Just... Yeah. Streets of New Capetta have had, had a nice. No, I gotta you know, leave it there because we have so to it, which is good. So I have no more. I do like Capetta. Oh, yeah. That is a word. That is a term. Uh, whenever an opponent Techno draws their second the card Sarah each Connor turn, I may draw oh, right. or may return Dog Detective from my graveyard to my hand. That's during their turn. And also, Dark this God. has a uh, thing on it, or if it dies, it actually is gonna end up getting exiled anyway, so that part is irrelevant. Okay. Go. Don't worry, nothing ever dies in a pre con game. <laughs> Alright. Board wipe! Have, have oh. you seen our boards? <laughs> On um, something tap. dies in a pre Gimme. game. Gimme! It dies in real life. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, how do I want to do this? Good question, Dan. Just pass. Let's no, start I have by two mana open for my revealing a mountain in my hand so that I may play a Fury Calm Snarl. As I Fury see. Calm and Snarl enters the battlefield, you may reveal a mountain or plains from your hand. If you don't, it enters the battlefield tapped. So. I, I synced it. <laughs> I seen it. I saw it. <laughs> have, but have you seen an elephant fly? Uh, yeah. In that cartoon. Have you have you thought about your list of suspects, Dan? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. I want to know if I could affect the outcome of who gets suspected. Oh. Why do you care? <laughs> He's got. Because I think it'd be funny if Crows and Cloudscraper was a suspect. Oh God. I'd say that's a likelihood. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Is it that obvious? Yeah. It's right. madness. Duelist's Heritage. Oh, Whenever shoot. one or more creatures attack, you may have target attacking creature gain double strike until end of turn. <laughs> Ouch. All right. Uh oh. Now let's move on to the attack my phase. Uh, sure. <sighs> Vince. Every fucking time. <laughs> Calm down, jeez. <laughs> I uh, didn't finish my sentence. <laughs> Maybe want to compliment you on your nice navy blue baseball cap. <laughs> Where can I send Nelly Borka? That's the question. Borky, bork, bork, bork. Let's see. Chris only has a 2-5. Um, that seems safest. So Nelly Borka is going at Chris. Yep. Lightning Rager is going at Vince. As I said, whenever <laughs> one or more creatures attack, you may have target attack and creature gain double strike until end of turn. Double strike, 5-1. Yeah, and I'll have to block Who's it. suspected? Uh, oh, good point. Just um, block with three old ones. Yeah, mm -hmm, they're all two-ones. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, you can't block with that. I might. <sighs> I'll do the logical away. thing. Yeah. Yay. Krosenberg, the... Uh, oh, God. Look at, this, look at this bigger suspect token. All man. suspects are now goaded as well. Oh, right. Keep that in mind. So, I need to block... Oh yeah, we're just gonna bounce with a lot, other. or I'm gonna take a lot. Yeah, five double strike trample. There's just no point in blocking it, unless. 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 It's only ten. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm just probably gonna just only. take it, I guess. <sighs> Join us in the teens. <laughs> what was I at? Twenty-two. Neat. Oh boy. Uh, I don't get to draw any cards for any. That's of that. the one good thing, I guess. 
Um, all right, main phase part two. The sequel. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, God. <clears throat> Spectacular showdown overloaded. What? Put a double strike counter on target creature, then goad each creature that had a double strike counter put on it this way. Overload. You may cast this spell for its overload cost. If you do, ah, change ah, the target ah. on its text to each. Each creature ah, ah, ah. has double strike and goaded. Dang it. Who's going to win this game? Yeah. I don't know. I just wanted to see how this uh, shakes out. If anyone had a counter spell, wow. that would be the time. Oh, you also have, or well, not yet, but yeah. soon. I have a feeling it's not getting back to my turn. <laughs> it's all the same here. You think Chris is going to kill both of you? Uh, he's Everything is double striked and goaded. Double strike, goaded, yeah. All right, move into my end step. <laughs> my God. Ooh, the well, question, question is, do you have a follow up to get out of this? Because once <laughs> everything's goaded and there's no one else to goad him yeah. and me, it I helps. don't think he's going to be able to kill you both. It'd be one shot here. Yeah, so one of you, but it's not. <laughs> <laughs> it's only one of you. I don't know. Only one. I said he's not gonna kill you both. <laughs> so only and I what stand by stand. that statement. Oh, my God. There I'm curious. To everything see is done. just double strike and goaded, right? It's not yeah. not trample. Yeah. It's still a Can things get double double strike? No. Double, uh, double. That's no fun. The cases of extra instances of double strike are redundant. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, speaking of redundancy, uh, this has nothing to do with redundancy. I have upkeep costs, so I have to pay two green to keep my crows in Cloud Scraper off. See, the he could have just let it die. Well, where's the fun in that? Why? I'm just saying, you it's, know, he doesn't have to ooh, kill you. He could have just not paid that and let it die. And It's who, though? Who is he going to, <laughs> to slap? I'll, I'll draw for two. That's what's so fun ready. about this. It's a spectacular showdown. It is. It's just trample and menace. I mean, it's just you know, go to go. It's not tra it's not trample is what I keep saying. It's not trample. It's you just double here. strike. Calm I down. can block it. Yeah, I only have one creature, so. So it's either you. <laughs> I can't even say. I understand anymore. why you would say that. I'll play this branch of Vitsugazi as my land. Uh, it could be disguised, but I will not do that. But he won't. It's just the land. <laughs> mm -mm. Oh boy. No, disguised as a creature? Yeah. It'd be super cool if this Shrine of Forsaken Gods was turned on right now, but it's not. <laughs> so. Will it get turned on before the game ends? Why do you have to say Stop such saying sexual things? <laughs> <laughs> You're the one making it will weird. Will he be able we to, heard you. Will gross. he be able to you utilize said it twice. its ability before the end? You knew what you now, did. That sounds better. I okay, English major. Uh, I think I'm going to have to do something to one of your creatures here, Chris. Fair. Mm. Which creature are you going to do the thing to? I think it has to be the Lightning Ranger. <laughs> Cause I was, really? Because really? it's 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 trample and double strike. Yeah. Well, not, okay, so that so alright, let me let me rewind this here. All of these have uh have been double strike the... and goaded. This just came into play this turn. So, so currently nothing. it does not have double strike. Granted, Dan And it's could... not even goaded. He doesn't have to attack with it, but he's gonna. <laughs> right. That doesn't have double strike? Right. No, no. It does, currently it does not. But it, Dan could give it double strike can, with yeah. Duel's Heritage if I attack. Dan, I keep waiting for him to declare attackers and then I can give it double strike. Those, oh, those, but I can sacri also be opportunist and I can say, you know. Because those which, what, sacrifice at the end do. and it's created at the beginning. Uh, so. I got gotcha. you. Yeah. I have a feeling Dan's probably going to do it anyways because everything else already has double strike. So I'm That's going to true, assume yeah. he's going to do that. Well, th doesn't this still play into that? Yes, yeah, so that's how I'm going to yeah. give it double strike. Right. Since double, double, double strike, double I can't that's, give things quadruple strike. I may as well that's what I assume. That. So that's why I wanted to pay two, sacrifice the ransom note, and go to the Lightning Ranger. Oh. oh. Vince is goading the Lightning Ranger. We get a different beat for that. Goad, goad, Lightning Ranger. And still might not save my life, but it has to come at you now. Uh, <laughs> luckily for Ken, it doesn't have to attack. Yeah. Yeah. If you would choose not to attack with it. Except that it's goaded. Is it? Oh. 
<laughs> he just goes. Yeah. I, Wait, literally, I literally just go to Right, it. that's right. Tough. <laughs> and I can't attack Dan. <laughs> that's exactly what that means. So let's circle this back around again. <laughs> At least it won't attack me. <laughs> All right, back to the dining hall. <laughs> okay, look. We're going to get a drag race board up here. <laughs> this. <laughs> We need some more red yarn. <laughs> or a cork board. <laughs> oh man. Okay. Uh, let's. I'm going to cast Panoptic Projector. Oh. Whew. All right. It's artifact. Next. The next face down creature spell I cast this turn costs three less to cast. So I tap to activate that effect. Uh, if turning a face down permanent face up causes a triggered ability of a permanent you control to trigger, that ability triggers an additional time. Oh no. All right. So I will use the panoptic projector so that the next uh, face down creature spell I cast this turn costs three less to cast. So this creature, this For free. creature is free. How oh, neat. Yay. Free. That's a new card. Yeah. yeah, no, it's an older one. Oh, um, okay. Yep. And then I'll I use Kaust to it's morph instead uh, of new one. Mm. Oh, son of a bitch. Turn target face down attacking what creature and control face up. Oh, yeah. Shoot. That, uh, that's. Whoops. Mm -hmm. Yeah, whoops. It didn't work out the way it. you thought it was. No, that's. You don't have haste, so. That's what I was. The guy thinking. with red doesn't have haste. That's a the Rager has haste. That's not even the problem. <laughs> I actually just wanted to turn this up for its trigger, but no, I don't. Yeah. I can't get that. Turn that one off, turn that one on. <sighs> turn the beat around. <laughs> Rough. No okay. rhythm of the wild. Anyway. Turn around. Back to combat. Uh, <laughs> okay, so this. Okay, this is a foregone conclusion. It, it has to go at Ken if I choose to attack with it, which I will. <laughs> Double strike. Thank you. Trample. I had to wait until he declared it attacking. Fair enough. People will get angry oh. if I don't wait until then. If you're angry about that, say something in the comments below. God, I hope it doesn't mean that. <laughs> He's right, but I'm angry he called me out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Gosh, how's he going to comment? They're turned off for this game. <laughs> <laughs> Is that most games? <laughs> I'll show you. I'll comment on the last one. Leave a comment. One. We want to hear from you, please. <laughs> we do really. Nobody ever responds to my Christmas cards. <laughs> <laughs> my bad. I'll get on that. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna try to kill Vince. Man. All these events. What? Rage wow. Rage, Rage Rick, that figures as much. I will block with this Adrix. Yep. And, uh, and so you lose. Nev Campbell. Okay, so you lose eight okay. overall. Okay. Instead of ten. All right. So which ones are the menaced ones? All right. So obviously the thirteen. I'm gonna block with two of these. Yep. Because that just makes sense. Yeah. How many did you have untapped? Yeah, four. four untapped. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Yeah. So I still have three untapped creatures. Um, <laughs> so currently, I would be taking two, four. I'd be twelve. Taking exactly. Twelve. Because they're all double strike. So I have to block some more. Block some more. I will block. Uh, they're both either a 2-2 two, two or a 2-5, right? So Yeah, but remember, they, you have to block with Reach or Flying. Yeah. Oh. Uh, all of them? Yeah. They all have power 2 or less, so... Creatures my opponent's control without Flying or Reach can't block creatures with power 2 or less. Okay, so these fly. Um, I will... Um, I'll block one. That would make me take eight. That's That's a lot. But either way, I can't survive no matter what. So yeah, I'll do sure. that. Yeah, because I, I wouldn't survive another turnaround yeah. anyways. Yeah, he's got to wait through your attack phase as well. Yeah, because yeah. he, he had to bank on you dying. Yeah, and I, I, I thought he would do it because it was no offense. I thought so. easy for him, but he chose not to for some reason. Yeah, I could have had the fun lulls with closing crowd scraper crushing can, but not so, this time. That's it. That's oh wait, I took eight. All right, detective. It is your turn. Okay. Upkeep trigger. Uh, at the beginning of my upkeep, investigate. So I will call it La Create. Another clue. So there's that. And whenever you draw your second card, which I haven't done yet. So draw my card. 
All right. Even though it's a card I don't like, but I'll, I'll just play it because it, it's it, it, it comes in, gods? yes, it comes in clutch. <laughs> when you actually have the mana. When you're drawing that in your opening hand, it's the worst. Yeah. Temple of the False God. Add two colorless. Activate only if you control five or more lands, which I do. So, I will immediately tap that to play a Talisman of Unity. Taps for colorless, or taps add a green or white. Talisman of Unity deals one damage to you. I will pay four. And I will play Sophia Dog Detective. When Sophia Dog Detective enters the battlefield, create a tiny, a legendary 2 2 green dog detective creature token with trample. So many dogs in this game. Pay one, sacrifice an artifact token. Put a 1 1 counter on each dog you control. Whenever a dog you control deals combat damage to a player, create a food token, then investigate. Unfortunately, it doesn't have haste. So this actually leaves me with... This guy was from New Capetta, wasn't he? Yes. That's what I thought. It leaves me with four mana. Tap the Idol of Oblivion, draw an additional card. Yay! Dan gets to draw a card. Uh, I get to add more tokens. You drew a card last turn when you uh, attacked, right, Chris? Oh, well, I did that. Whenever you draw your second you. card... And then I think I should have drawn another two. one of your end step. Yeah. Sweet. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, so that really is six now because I drew my second card. But this gets three, four, five, six. So, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, four. So he's a fourteen. <laughs> he's big. All right, that did not change my. All right. All right. I believe I have something that's going to do something that's going to be a little crazy here. Oh, oh no. You're going to solve the murder case and find out you're the I murderer? don't know if it's going to give me any kind of victory uh, right away. But, oh, wow. The moral um, victory? So I'm going to I'm gonna tap three of these because I'm going to improvise right now. So that's three, oh. four. That's a payoff to the joke I made at the start of this video. Five. No one remembers that. <laughs> Oh, shoot. It might not work. I don't think it was going to work. But I'm going to play Kappa. <laughs> Kappa Cannoneer. Ooh. Ward 4. Whenever an artifact enters the battlefield under your control, put a 1 1 counter on Kappa Cannoneer, and it can't be blocked this turn. Oh. Fun fact he counts himself. Yeah. Oh, he does? Yeah. Oh, sweet. <laughs> Blastoise is a good Pokemon, I hear. So right now he's a 5 5. All right, so I got stuff to block now. Um, but I still have to attack with two things. I could wipe out Vince. This is true. I could wa and, uh, not wipe out Chris, because I would take him down to one. No, you'd kill me. Yeah, everything's double oh, strike. Oh, Commander? Double, double strike. Double strike, dude. Gotcha. Gotcha. Yeah, so you can Speaking of which, yeah. once you declare attackers, I'm gonna make that one double strike. Hmm. Only okay. a true villain would reveal his plan so soon. Alright, well then I'll just <laughs> uh, Chris. Double strike. And Vince is gonna get the lightning ranger. <laughs> oh, I'm dead. I'm yeah. dead. Wow. Double homicide. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> And at least I got something to block. Well, I don't have to really worry about Dan, but go oh. don't matter knows more. <laughs> uh, you get to draw a card, I get to draw a card. And then I get to draw a card, and no. And then on your end step, I get to draw a card. Yeah. And I have to reveal Are this. you on your end step? Uh, Ash Cloud Phoenix. On. That was the morph target. Okay. I wanted. I was going to do four damage to people when it flipped, but mm. I, did, I could not. Look what that is. Okay, well... Since I have two mana left and I have no instants and or sorceries information, uh, I will play in my second main on the trail. It's an enchantment. Whenever you draw your second card each turn, you may put a land card from your hand onto the battlefield tapped. I don't know if that's gonna uh, help my game at all, but we're gonna see. And now I'm gonna pray and pass the damn. <laughs> well, you have a lot of stuff out, Ken. Yeah, I do. I just don't know what he's going to pull out of his um, back pocket here. He's going to attack you with a rager. Yeah, that's a 
That's a no. So if that has double strike and trample, I hope you can block it or you'll be dead on that. Because yeah. it's going to be 10 that you'll have to block. Mm -hmm. Or enough of, you know. And then probably his commander, maybe? He doesn't have anything with haste? I don't know. I thought I was going to have enough to do that. That's yeah. cool. Yeah. Untap. Draw. How many creatures you can block? From downtown. With? I have three, three creatures currently. I have a 5-5 five, five with ward 4, a 3-4, and a 2-2. Two, two. A tiny 2-2. Two, two. <laughs> 3-4 and a 2-2, two, two, eh? Yeah, but that can change because it. I can pay one, sacrifice an artifact, put a 1-1 one, one counter on each dog you control. <laughs> All right, well, let's just jump right into attacking. Um, let's jump into attacking. I am going to attack with everything, obviously. Whenever one or All more creatures I control, you may have target attacking creature gain double strike until end of turn. So that one has double strike trample. Uh, whenever Nelly whatever uh, attacks, <laughs> uh, suspect target creature. Uh, he has ward, right? Ward four, yeah. Uh, let's just... Uh, Knock out your 3 4. Oh, that's right, because it can't block. It's suspected? Yeah. Yeah. So the goaded's irrelevant, but it can't block when it's suspected, which is yeah. huge for him. Yeah, it's big. And it's goaded? Yeah. Yep. Not that that means anything anymore, other than it has to attack. Mm -hmm. And in this case, you. <laughs> I'm aware. Which is unusual for me. Mm. Um, people attacking you? No. No, being aware. Oh. <laughs> uh, Wait, what's going on? <laughs> okay, so I will block with my Kappa, Cannoneer, and Tiny. So that's four, five, six. Which one which? Uh, that's a these, five. Yeah, no, or five. So five, six, seven, I will block this. You're sending them both at that? Mm-hmm. Okay. So that's three. So two. Four, five. Right? Yeah. Commander. All right. I don't know what kind of crazy crap he has going on. Why did you give it to Chris? <laughs> <laughs> Are we actually passing now? Not yet. Oh. I got all yeah. my mana. Oh, right. you gave the I guess I'll hold on to the Ranger. Yeah, because it did die. Yeah. Let's, uh... Where did I put that card? There's too many I here. Guess which one of these is <clears throat> the Ranger? Can you figure out which one it could possibly be? <laughs> One, two, three, or four, where, five. Where is it at, man? It's under the skull. <laughs> Winds of Wrath. Oh, shit. Destroy all creatures that aren't enchanted. They cannot be regenerated. Oh, well, that's a thing. Yeah. That aren't enchanted? Yeah. Okay. A board wipe in a precon? No. There's like at man. least one. What a play, because you were about to die. Horde. Then I will play <laughs> a Temple of the False Gods. What? Bomb turn 13 play. It's only like turn 8. I know. <laughs> that game went fast. Yeah. It's not over yet. For you. Yeah. For Lauren of the Fourth Path. Or no, the Third Path. Ooh. Uh, Vigilance, when it enters the battlefield, destroy up to one target artifact or enchantment. Mm. Yep, makes uh, sense. Tap for you and a target opponent to draw um, a card. All right. Did I miss any other triggers? Okay. Oh, this should have incremented. There we go. Go ahead. <laughs> Full skull. Oh, okay. Untap, 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 draw. Oh, yeah, these are untapped. Ooh. Two choices I can make here. <laughs> Only two. Have you seen every possible permutation of the universe? Dan, you're going to make this double strike? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> and which one of the universes does Dan not make a double strike? Ah, oh, shoot. This don't mean nothing anymore. <laughs> Since it can't be green. Well, it can't be green. I only have one green. You can make white and red with it. Yeah. I can make green there, too, so I actually can do... Wow, that would really be... <laughs> it would go down to one by using it for green. <laughs> I know. Ooh, spicy. Yeah, no shizzle. Spicy tofu. I will play 
Hydroid Crisis. Uh, oh. When it enters the battlefield, gain half X life where you draw X, uh, half X cards rounded down each time. So I paid eight for it. So you get four life and you draw four, four cards. cards. So. And it's an eight, eight yep. flying trample? Yep. Wanna well, goad, goad it? <laughs> well, that actually is better than what I thought you were going to do. I was going to, I was thinking Did you draw thing. that or something? No. Oh. Okay. Can you life? Yeah. yeah. So one, two, three, four. Man. Now yeah, you can use that for green mana. <laughs> your turn, you may put a land card from your hand onto the battlefield, which I will put this land card for drawing my second card from on the trail. I still haven't played a land. For I gotta bounce something. You gotta, yeah. Yeah, you gotta oh, I know. return some. I will return this. Is land. But I still haven't played a land for turn. So I will play this forest. So now I have a basic forest. So now I've played a land, did all the stuff. You attacking? I'm moving to attack with this lightning rager. Five Are one. all attackers declared? I only have one to attack with, yes. Just I'm attacking. Out. You can't attack Dan with the lightning rager. Oh. Oh, right. But I wanted him to. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good point. Yeah. Okay then, yeah. And I only have one mana, so... Moving to my second main. Pass two. At the beginning of your end step, I'm gonna flash in Otherworld Escort. Bam. Okay. All right. And what does it do? When it dies, it has flash. When it dies, if it's not a spirit, return to the battlefield under its owner's control with four charge counters on it. It's a spirit detective. Uh, pay to tap to remove a charge counter from blah, blah, blah. It doesn't matter. Oh, Dan, you want, you're mind blown? Your smuggler share gets to do something else too this time. Why's that? Because Ken had two lands that are play this turn. Oh, yeah. neat. Uh, what do I get for that? I get a treasure token. Yay! You found the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. <laughs> <laughs> that too, I guess. Yeah, that happened. All right. Uh, on tap. It's okay, you got an 8-8. Eight, eight. You got this. Alright. I don't know, because he might <laughs> blow it up or something. Yeah, that's... Yeah, well, unless he's got removal, you still wouldn't win, because he's at 10. But unless he's got... <laughs> How many creatures you got? <laughs> he's got one. I got one, oh. eight, eight. Okay. Hydroid Crisis. I'm... Uh, I got a draw. Let's see. Alright, I know I asked this. How many blockers do you have? One. One. I think I win. Really? Do it. Um, let me, let me prove up all my blockers so you can Because a lightning rager. Who's the yeah. killer detective? Lightning rager will be 10 because you'll probably make it double strikes. So then he can block eight of it, which two gets, I don't see how, oh, now I do. So everything came in before the start of my turn. So none of them have summoning sickness. Yep. So I attack with everything and I make him double strike. Oh. Interesting. So you've got seven and four double strike, or you've got uh, six, ten, and five. Oh, I guess I don't win. Me dumb. I have an eight. I can only block one. Wait, yeah, no, sorry. Yeah. You can only block one. Have you Kobayashi removed Ken here? Uh, unless he's got some sort of instant or something I missed or. Uh, yeah, no, he really does have me either way. Yeah, because yeah, that on its own does eight to you. If you block here, that's ten. If you block that, you take yeah. seven. Yep. If yeah. you block the rager, you... Uh, Got that fog with that one green? Uh, no. Dang. I die. Good job. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I, was, I really wanted you to attack me with the lightning rager so that I could give it double strike and then play selfless squire. Ooh. <laughs> oh. So when, his, when he was like, oh, you can't attack with him, I was like, no, my plan! 
It's because it was loud. <laughs> All according to Keikaku. Wow. Jeez, that nice deck. Job, that man. deck did uh, some work, wow. man. Oh. I had a lucky start, though, with a soul uh, ring. Yeah. And I was able to tutor for the uh, mountain I needed. It was like everyone did a to little bit, but locking up everyone's commanders, can't yes. block, can't do like it. Like, That's hard work. Like, I got to do like, a lot of what my commander does, but I didn't mm -hmm. get to, like, send it fourth as much yeah. as I wanted to. I mean, I did three or four times, but... Wow. Yeah, I was hoping to turn more creatures face up, but yeah, yeah I got right. to do the cool thing with cra with Cloud Scrapers. Yeah, yeah. I'm happy about that. <laughs> well, good job, Dan. That is... Yeah. Wow. Victory to you. Victory to you. It helps to have half your deck in your hand. Yes. <laughs> oh, for draw sure. Cards like with Draw crazy. power, man. Wow. That's what does it. Bomb wow. Wow. That's... Wow. Well, GG's Dan, the uh, Boros Precon, Nelly, got hot in here. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, more puns. <laughs> That's terrible. We did make a single Nelly Furtado joke. I don't get it. I mean, I have a Furtado. She's in our um, musical. Oh, oh, she is? I don't know her music at all. So. Is that her last name? Nelly Furtado. I don't know if it's her real last name, but it's her... Stage, stage name? Stage name, Nelly Furtado, yeah. Is it her real stage name? Yes. <laughs> Remember, everything you see here was not staged. Totally real. So, <laughs> well, now they think it was staged. We're going to go hang out backstage after this? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> as long as you got your passes. Backstage passes. <laughs> well, we solved the murder. The, not the murder, but... <laughs> Dan solved the murder by killing all of us. Yeah. It was you three. Yeah. <laughs> it was you three, and I just killed you in response. There it is. Man. Back to, oh, thanks. So, uh, if you guys like what you saw or have anything else to say, or if you guys want to see these decks maybe um, homebrewed with the same commander, see what they can do without being a precon, let us know in the comments. Uh, if you guys like uh, what you see, please give us a like. Subscribe helps us, helps you, helps us grow, definitely. Yeah, share with your friends, and hey, you're at the end of this video, but we got a lot more down uh, in our playlist where you can check, check more out. Make it a magic term, we have X episodes available. Mm. <laughs> How much money are you going to spend to watch those? No. <laughs> Dan gets it with the Boros win. Nice job, Dan. GG. Ooh,